We have a model made here of all the different formations of the metal the bullnose drywall finish will work on. And here's just some of the metal that it will work on. I'm going to lay them down here. We're talking about bullnose inch and a half metal. We're talking about the flex metal. We're talking about the J-speed, also the door metal, the half inch and a half, three-quarter inch, the large round bullnose. It has a angle for each one of these. This is a bullnose that goes up against the, the door jam. Here's a tape-on bullnose metal, and then the corner bead. The pocket handrail finisher is a flexible tool. It's used for forming all these different uh, radiuses and corners on the bullnose metal and on the inside corners. The great thing about it is that we call it the tool with a memory. The reason being is that no matter how you bend it, however you shape it, it always returns to its original shape. In drywall, as a drywall finisher, like I said, it works in concrete, stucco, tile, bondo filler, it can be used for all these different cross-marketing sections of the store. But in drywall, they coat the corner beads and you have a residue left over on each corner. And what makes it nice with the pocket hound is once you coat it with your knife, you coat these different angles, you took inside corners, get this ready, the pocket hound comes right along and cleans the edge cleans it right off. And the great thing about it, it goes right back into your pan. Like if you had to try to clean it with your six inch knife, you would have to work at it like this, do it, then pull it, and then, then later sand it. But like I say, the pocket hound has all the different angles. That was three quarters. Here's an inch and a half. Cleans that also. Also, you can form round corners with it because of its flexibility. And there's not even a tool out yet for this right here. This is for uh, like a J metal. It's called a kerf metal that goes up against the door jam. You have to coat it, and this is like the door jam. You take the pocket hound, clean that edge right off. Also, you can take this side, form the inside round corners. If you want a tighter corner, you can use this part right here to form a real tight corner. And like I say, it'll also form, you have radiuses, round radiuses. You can also form the round radiuses. See right here, let's see how that works? You can form them. And then it just wipes right off back into your pan. That's the great thing about it. One of the great things about the pocket hound is a six pack display box. Six tools in each box. Has a display on the front. It can be used as in the planogram or on any shelf or by the cash register. It's also customer friendly packaging. We have a cutout on the front of the package so you can feel the flexibility of the tool. And also we have photos on the front showing the use of the tools. On the back we have a complete information diagram and also a brochure that tells more details about the pocket hound, the drywall finisher, and the pocket cart, the panel carrier, and the pocket kicker, the panel lifter. Also we have put feet on the back so you can set the pocket hound, the drywall finisher, by any cash register. Also this tool can be used in stucco, concrete, masonry, tile, and even bondo filler. It's a great cross-marketing tool, just like the pocket cart and the pocket kicker are both cross-marketing tools.